Hey guys, welcome to Codes with Tom. Today we are making an explains like a console based program implemented in C. Managing personal finance application provide features to user authentication, expense tracking and profile management. Look at the how it's work. So firstly we sign up. My name is Om. My username is Om. Four. No, no. Om seven. My password is a ninety-eight. You can choose whatever you want password. My email is Om at red gmail dot com. And age is a nineteen. The money salary is a thirty dollar. Five thousand. Then we want to log in. My username is Om seven. My password is a ninety-eight. Login successfully. Successfully, I want to add expense. I want to add firstly a home rent is a five hundred. Then it is a I paid twenty three zero one two thousand twenty four like this. You should add this symbol. I forget it to add this symbol. Total spent. No, you don't have to add a. We add expense lot of more. We add EMI. It is the five hundred we paid in twenty two zero and this sign and twenty and first sorry this sign and first month and another this sign twenty four like this. We also add this. Yeah, that is also given here. And now we want to add a night. We want to total spend. Is for the house. House rent is five hundred. EMI is five hundred. You want list of the thing. And you want to the view profile. So we five view profile is the basic budget. Salary month monthly. We can calculate here and add budget here. Simply six. Add a profile. We add the monthly budget is five hundred and see view profile. Monthly budget is five. So we add add also profile. So we log out. If you want to make this code, let's make it. Let's start the coding. Firstly, create a file. Expense record. Hey guys, first of all, hey guys, let's code. First of all, create a file. Expense record dot c. Then we simply add a header files. No bother. Plate. Simply we here create a lot of which which items. An expense we want to add. Actually, so here we write a constant. Constant. C O N S T constant. C O N S T constant. Obviously, character and item. Item name in pointer. I T E A M. The name name. Then choice. We have put a simply a choice. C H O I C E choice. Then here we add a curly brackets, and we use a switch case. W I T -E. switch. And obviously, remove this. We don't have this expression. We here put a choice. Choice. Then case one. We don't want a break. Obviously, we remove it. And case one, in case one, we return a simply add return. Here we want to house rent. Here show you. Yeah, see house R E N T house rent. Second one our case two. In case two, we add a return. Return food. food. Then case three. Case three. Return mobile. Then we simply copy. We simply add six. We add a six. Fourth one is the clothes. Cloth also important. 
हाउस फूड मोबाइल प्लॉट फिफ्थ वन इंच ट्रांसपोर्ट टीआर एन एस पी ओ आर टी ट्रांसपोर्ट सिक्स वन थ्री ऑब्वियसली एम आई सॉरी इधर भी राइट हियर सिक्स पर इन रिमोट सिंगल टू लाइक एंड डिफॉल्ट रिमो हियर ब्रेक स्टेटमेंट And in default, we write a simply invalid item. Default return in valid item. That's it. Now, now we create a structure. For the account, like login account, we here we use a same Instagram format: login, log out, sign in, sign up, like that. Simply we use a type def. Why? For we'll initializer, use a different keyword. We use a we use a struct. Yes, T R U C T. Struct expense not expense tracker. We add use a. A C C O U N T account. Then here we write a A C V A small C like that. Then here we simply write a name, username, and much more things. Here we write a sorry, write a char the name name. You will erase hundred. Then we use a char user name hundred. Then char pass. Then we put a sixty four. It's enough password. Then char email email obviously one fifty. In now we sally not first we reach is most important. Then we here a mistake in email spelling. Yum a uh, email then here we write up salary. Yeah say here a r was salary. Then so what we write up. So far, then float B U D G E T budget float so far first I am it's seven. Like that. Now it's enough. Now we add here a int. Right here a constant. On and int max user is equal to five hundred. Then A C, sorry, capital A C. We write ID. Here we write a max user. Then in choice for or loop or loop. Here not clear. Here we write a in index. If you see my old videos, you can clearly see how we use an index. See my last videos already uploaded in our channel. If you are watching the video, please make sure you subscribe the channel. At least like the video, please.
the name and chat. Here you write the email. And you also join my Twitter. Twitter link is given by the description. And you also join GitHub. GitHub link and this source code link also give in a description. Please see it. You also get more codes and upcoming videos. This is our last video on C. Later we we'll talking about a C plus plus. Technically, it's a last, but theoretically not a. You can comment with topics. We add a videos on your C program. Please comment down. I know you think this is not worth it, but but plus me, it's worth it. Right? Here we write our next line for formatting. Here we write a e x p e n c expense p e r a c k e r expense tracker, and here we simply copy this. Here to here, and here we write the next line semicolon print, and here we write in one line or s minus. Here we write a login. Sorry. Very, very sorry. Here we write the login. Log in next line. Here we write the two. For second, here we write the yes, I G N sign up. We use this for the spacing. We don't want to write add more lines on our code because you get also big project. It is a like a six to seven options to user to interact with it. I think it is a most lengthy video on till date. Fourth. Fourth one is a sorry, it is a third one. Now. One, it is a third one. Fourth one is quota spend. Here we write a log out. Log out. Or exit the program. Next line. And semicolon. And simply we print a pattern. Minus. Minus pattern. It's enough. It's enough and print enter your 
choice. Enter your choice, then you will write a scan F. And store the value using a ampersand. We simply store a choice. In choice. Here we write a while. Choice. Now simply, here we add a switch case. Switch. And here we add a choice. Choice operator. Give a choice operator. In case. In simply first case, we simply add here a one, one, and then simply we print, we print this. And here we change here, here we later login. Simply like that, and here we print username. And one important thing don't give here a next line this function not use because here we use a scanf. Here we write a scan F and you use a yes ping because it is adding and here we write a username. And here we simply copy here password. If you thinking why we, we here uh, first put here a function of uh, login, why don't you use here a uh, sign up? Because if you log in Instagram ID, you always see your login, then you see your you don't have account, then you see your sign up. That's why we use a uh, firstly a login, then sign up. And here we use us. Now let's do come to the functions. Firstly, we we make a functions for all types. Firstly, we add here a login. We add a int. Write a space space. And here we write a login int. Sorry, L O G login. Then username. Then here, pass, then AC ID, then in total, total users, then here we write a simply functions, functions command, like uh, we use a for loop called int i is equal to 0 and related then to the total users total users then i plus plus in for loop user if function if we use a string function like a string compare str c m p string compare obviously it is a most necessary function to compare Username and password is right or wrong. Here we put a simple username. Then already username exists. Here we write a I and here we use a username. Then if A is a two, it gives equal equal to the zero and and yes TR. Simply for pass, pass then ID I pass 
is equal to equal to the zero, then here we will return simply a i. Return a i. As you know, in array, index starting with a zero, zero, one, two, three. Like this style compared username and password. This user found in a array zero. And I I returns I returns a one. But we want zero because this ID found in a zero zero index. But I return one. Here we simply minus. Here we write a U R L return minus one. If this user found in 29 position, 29 index, and here we here we write here 29. But the real user location in this array, in this array, is a 28. But here we return a 29. Then we simply return minus 1. 28, 29 minus 1 is a 28. We got the answer. Right? Simply now we add another function. Here we will use a void. S I G and sign. Yep. We don't want a int because here we simply store the values. Here we write an index. As you know. If you're watching me by first video video. Please watch my first videos. Then here we use a char pass. Here we write a char email. Ah, मुझे आपसे एक और बात पूछनी थी. आप किस field से हो और आप किस team से हो ये भी बताना मुझको नीचे. आप BSc, से हो, B से हो, BE से हो, किससे हो आप? मुझको पता चलेगा. Because I am a BTEC first year CSE student. Or you can year CSE student. I think C is the first language in my opinion. That's why you all come here from a first. Total users, then here we write a program in or function. We use a if pointer index is then total users, then print this and then execute this. We here will return a for loop int i is equal to zero greater than is equal to the pointer index i plus plus. Here you will simply write a if function if str cmp install we simply user user username sorry username then id i username equal equal to the zero then print Print this user name is or already taken like a Instagram. Instagram also written this to us. If all user name is already exist, they tell us this is. Not available. Here we write already taken. Simply a simplistic manner. Now, shall we want to the add index? Now we want to the add all letters in this. Now here we write a out of for loop. Here we write a
if you if you put in here they are the giving a they not giving a this error but they are a mistake they gives you a bounce back and your pc and laptops also classes we simply copy here we use her simply we copy this and paste uh, list of the thing like this if here we write a name yeah here you here we write a name and here we write a PA pass like this here we write a pass and then here we write a email Here we write email. They are the arrays. That's why we use a star function. This is a float and this and float and integer. We don't want to use them. Star function. We simply add here a hash. star index age equal to the page then simply we copy here this and paste the rest of the thing for three two three four like this and here we put a total we here we write a total is equal to the zero point zero because they are in a float and here we write a salary Salary and budget. And here we also read a budget. No, no, no. We not add a budget. Zero point zero. Like that. And here we use another for loop. Here we write up for total item int i zero. Here we write a seven plus plus. Here we write id index id index then total for item i equal to zero point zero. Then out of a for loop, here we print the user created successfully. Print f user t r e a is created successfully. Next line. Then here we write a simply a index plus plus then close then here we write up error error handling here we use the errors for all error handling printf ercr ver Work is full. You can me also very no and related to the these things. No server exists in C, but our satisfaction and customer satisfaction is our motto. This dialogue you seen in the TMKOC Jetalal. That's why. If we decided here uh, with how many your maximum user is five hundred. If if this program uses more than five hundred people, you and me also know this much people can't use this this program in one time. But 
something is better than nothing. Oh, here we write a void. Third one is or add expense. E X P E N S E X expense. Then A C. user then here we write a we simply copy this thing and paste this thing here and simply did here new one add here add and simply we use a expense here will write up int item C H O R C H item choice what item choice load x tense yum o u guarantee amount expense amount then character date We add characters in date. Simply print f. Then we use the next line. A V A I L A B L A available. X P N C expense. Here we simply added all necessary things in here. In here, so this is like a household food, mobile, clothes, transport, EMI. And here also, we add these similar things which here, here. Now we print another line, print, and we simply add here also. First one, H O U S A house, R E N T rent. Next line. Food. Third one is third one is B I L E mobile. Fourth one is a cloth. Fifth one is a transport. E E M I. Next line. Then print. Then we print the next line and enter the number follows pointing to the x pins in this line. We put the all grammars that we learn in the first standard to tenth standard. That's a joking. You write items. And I know one thing in me don't want to watch this part in this video because no one watch my full video but i love making the videos that's why i'm making because in this channel i got only a three or four views they are from my friends And they also not have watched full video. They only watch some part. Include 
and skip this video. If you are watching this part, it's miracle for me. Please comment below if you are watching this part. Enter the amount then And another one thing I tell you, I don't copy anyone. I know this is a list. The, the same idea uses all projects done already, but this is mine. Not like an idea and this features is also my own. I even don't watch any other video for creating this. And all the rest of my videos are also original. If I copy someone, I tell first you. In first, it low. This this code is copy from X Y Z, but this is more code is mine. X. Hence. Amount then and here we write up user then minus sign and here we write up user then total or keeper item then here we write a item choice. Item choice view perfectly minus one. Watch carefully this step plus is equal to expense amount. Then we simply print new line e x p n c e expense a. Data yes, you double C E double yes. fully new line then print F I T E M then percentage not percentage is modulus yes new line then amount in u and the amount then we simply add a modulus point to f point to f then 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 next line we use a next line simply for better looking formatting data modulus yes next line then we simply add her Variables item name, item choice, expense amount, date, date, This function is ready. Now we simply add a void. We void the void order pend. Just P E and this pain. Then we simply add here function AC account pointer. Simply add here user, not much. And we write a code here. We simply copy here. We simply copy here and paste here. Sorry, testing double time. We simply change. 
Enter PND Spain like that. Then we simply add float total spend total spend is equal to the user user totals then we semicolon give semicolon and print give us this for better looking formatting then next line total yes p e and we spend for p a c h item then next line then here sorry 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 we want to add here another there will be print print total paint for our time percentage 2.5 new line total spend then here we simply give a for loop and the entire is equal to one greater than equal to the six i plus plus can we print module can we print modulus sorry sorry can we print modulus yes then modulus point two f then new line then item name here you hear the writer i then user total item i minus one then it's done total spend is done we also add a view profile or view profile we add a void void pi view profile profile then ac modulus user then in this we simply not light much of things of here just here here we write a v i u w view so right then bring it a of any m name then modulus yes new line user name then yes new email in then percentage yes and next line the next line we simply add here h modulus d next line sorry yes a your a r y sorry then modulus point two f next line the motion p yeah yeah one one three b u d b e t budget is modulus point two f next line no need not the next line we simply are right like this you see program it's 
working we can complete our next line to here because we don't want to go longer than much that's why we write here user name then user username then email then age then salary then budget it is complete semi column you semi column and it's covered the profile is complete now we want to last option is edit profile we simply this is our last last function we simply edit 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 pro profile the profile then ac user and simply we edit profile then we print enter new monthly budget budget simply like that and scan f then modulus f then we simply put in budget we write a user budget then here we write a if condition if user budget is less than zero and then print in valid budget value we are here as you please enter a non negative value we put this if function for error handling if you if you user mistakenly add a minus sign then it's run because it's not a not a practically possible budget budget is equal to 0 0.0 it will and here we print a million t yeah chill by monthly g t budget up the data access fully here we print the next line then move to the main code move to the main coding process here we already add a case one now we want to add case two three four and five not our case one is not perfectly done simply we add more sorry sorry log user index is equal to login username pass then i know id then index right here we write a if 
login index not equal to the minus one then print next line law in as you is full next line else print f in valid user name or pass password next line then here we simply add a here we add a simply add a case here we add a case 2 and here we add a simply case 2 and we write a print f sorry sorry we simply copy here we forget we forget and here we write a sign up here sign g and sign up the name Your name, your name, and then can F model is yes, name, and then print F, print F, username, we simply copy here, here cookies, and paste here because we want this. Username and first done and email. Now we are add also email print f print f email then And sorry for the mistake. We had a scan F. And here we will write the module as yes. Then email. Then write print the print F. And then page. And then module as D for the A story edition. Page. Then Print of salary. Here moon th ly monthly. Yes, ly ry monthly salary. Then we simply can f modulus f. Then to a salary in this. And then we call a function. Sign up and we simply and and percent and and percent index then name then username then pass then email then age then salary then id then max user and this simply done that's that what's happened here Unexpected identifier. 
sorry. What solid percent index right here? New right here, the break. What is that? It's already given. I already give it. One second, one second, one second, one second, one second. Total users, right? Total users is max. Max users. Like this. Then this. We saw later this problem. We saw later. Simply we add a case three. Case three. In case three, we use a if function. If login again index not equal to the minus one, then add expense. We simply can ID and login index call else print F. We simply P L E A S E please. Log in to add an expense. Then we simply break we simply break here. In break, we add a case four. Case four. Simply like this. If function, we call it function, and we simply change the total spend. Then we change the login. Oh. Take the spn dig spending like that. Then we simply break like that. We add is by and we simply copy this and paste here and we simply change this. And we profile add a view profile simple and view profile to view login to VI EW view the profile break then six one is a I think uh, 46 one is a uh, eight of IED the last. Thank God. It is the last, and here we write a. Uh, we want to create a profile. Oh, sorry. Break and here you write down. Yes, A one, and here we print F E X I T I N G exiting.
and here we use a default printf sorry printf read input comma plea is please enter read next line done and he will write a break then is done we see uh, open Add expense, done, 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 check, 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 done, 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 done. All code is done. We simply save it. Terminal, no terminal. Simply it's a new. It's running. Now we can firstly sign up. No, if you want to sign up, my name is Om. My username is Om. My password is 98. My email is Om 0 at the red gmail.com. My age is sorry, 90. My monthly income is approximately 4 to 1 lakhs. You can trade it successfully. Then we want to the add expense. As we know, we put the logic handle in here. Error handling. If you don't log in, only a sign up, you don't log in. It on tells firstly log in. So, firstly, we will add to the add expense. Please log in to add expense. We place a view profile. Please log in to view profile. Simply that. We log in. And then my username is home. My password is 98. Login successfully and we want to add expense. We want to the home rent. Home spend is 8,807.01.2004.2024. Like and we want to the to spend. Home rent 3000. Then we want to the view profile 5. See, we don't add budget here. That's why it is zero. We don't add here. Oh, my username is the age, username, name. We don't add here. Add mobile number. You should add a mobile number in your profile. What the budget is 5000. See, I view profile. Monthly budget is 5000. It's the interactive console panels we created in expense planker. You should create it. Watch this video and create this. If you like this video, please make sure you subscribe the channel and please make that on the notification bell. For the notification bell, you want to subscribe. So make sure you subscribe the channel. Source code, no, source code link is given in below. Thank you.